Hey guys, I'm Will Coomer and uh, Zinix, and welcome to the Newgrounds Podcast. Welcome to the Newgrounds Podcast. Today's episode hosted by Will Comer and Zinzinix. Yeehaw! Welcome everybody to the Newgrounds Podcast. I have today with me Will Comer, and we are presenting Woo. a very special episode. Some kind of big brain boy on Newgrounds. You may know his name, Ninja Muffin 99, and his uh. team of collaborators. They came out with an amazing game called Friday Night Funkin'. And if you That's haven't right. gotten down with the funk, then you don't know what you're missing. I'm here with Ninja Muff 99, Phantom Arcade, Quite oh. Sprite, and then Evil Skaters on the way, but they're not here currently, so we we had to start. They'll come, they'll come. They're they're driving, they're driving home right now. They are racing home. He stopped on the way here at a gas station to get a Snickers bar. <laughs> he had to quench his hunger. <laughs> he can't find his credit card. He's just trying to fish it out and get it to the gas station guy. So he's going to be here in maybe an hour or so, uh, eating a Snickers loudly into the microphone. Yeah. Yeah, we'll get them. We'll get them. We're also yeah. very sleep deprived. <laughs> yeah. I had a good three hours of sleep. Funkin' on a Saturday. Oh, yeah. You just got back from like a trip. I, I got back from a plane. I don't like flying. Flying sucks. It's scary. And uh, I'm tired. Neither did you wear your mask? <laughs> you did that on company time. So that's, that's company- coming out of your paycheck. <laughs> I took a vacation right when we dropped the, the thing on Newgrounds. And I never got a chance to play it because I, I don't have a laptop or anything. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh god! Right when we needed you the most. Hmm. Yeah, Friday Night Funkin' on mobile now. That's what he's saying. That's what he's yeah. saying. <laughs> Jeez. Jesus, this game is freaking blowing up, and I'm so like happy for you guys that it's gotten the success it's gotten already, and it's kind of just now being this new thing everybody's finding. Are you guys just freaking pumped about that? Yeah, it's quite. Quite scary. Quite scary to see it all. Ninja Muffin, dude, I saw your followers go up from like, I forget what you're at, like 600. It's now like 2,600. I was like, damn, like everyone really caught on. Once they heard Bo Peepo, like everyone's pants <laughs> dropped immediately. <laughs> yeah. Well, originally, the first one's fresh by good old Isaac. And Isaac is is doing numbers on Twitter too, I guess. And, and Newgrounds too. Yeah. Where... And Newgrounds too. <laughs> Newgrounds too. Uh, I was more excited to get. 1,000 Newgrounds followers than like yeah. a crap ton of Twitter followers. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. That's true. Uh, that's true. It's a lot harder to get the Newgrounds followers. So like 1K on Newgrounds is like, holy shit. Like people actually care. Like, you know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? It's not just some fucking like fad or phase. In Quest, right? You've had, you've been having like kind of like, uh, I don't want to say a rough year, but like finally people are like, damn, this this is really good fucking like video game music or like something you could throw into a project like that the idea of everyone's voices not being like actual like words but being like noises or like however you want to put them like the phonetics of the singers yeah. on both sides it goes so well with your music style and i'm like damn like thank god we got quite right on this like what a crazy project to just to just work on for three days and come out with something insane like yeah. Ludum Dare fucking 47. Like, how did you even get mm-hmm. that team together? Like, how did you, you guys are like the A team, I guess, in my, in my right. fucking eyes. <laughs> Where'd the start? The, the team coming together. That was, uh, I woke up noon, uh, October 3rd <laughs> or so. Uh, and I, <laughs> I saw Twitter. I saw Twitter.com. There was some game that was, uh, oh, Ludum Dare coming up today. And I was like, oh, wait, that's in three hours. Let's see. Let's see who's. <laughs> Let's see who's online on Discord. I'm in the mood. And uh, I went through and I f- f- was hunting down a few people. And they all said, no, you're, you're crazy. Three hours? No, I, I, I got things to do. And then I, I hit up uh, Kid Brute. And he said uh, he wasn't able to do it. But he tossed me towards Evil Skater, which I've never like interacted with. I've never like talked to before the game jam. So I was like, oh yeah, I'll, I'll work with this new man. And then I hit up like Phantom Arcade. I was, I was bottom because, of the barrel picks. Uh, last one. <laughs> last of the dodgeball team. Last on the dodgeball mm-hmm. team. <laughs> and I hit up him because like a day or two before, I wrote like this news post and he's like, oh yeah, we still got to make a game together. I was like, hmm, let's see if this man, let's, let's see if this man is up to when it. He sent it to me. I was like, let's shit. see if this man's putting his money where his mouth is. Shit, I promise yeah. I'd do that. Damn. <laughs> 
<laughs> now, Ninja Muffin, did you already have the idea of like like a little of like someone's someone's trying to date this chick, right? And then the evil dad, and then the good guy dude, like all this hipster kind of kind of art coming out for it. Even the chick. Well, that it, came out. Uh, that that was, that was Phantom Arcade, but I came in and I was like, I want to make a Parappa. Yeah, he did. Like, he did hit me with Parappa then, like, from the very later. beginning, and that's it, it. Did catch my eye because I'm a big fan mm. of. I think we all are big fans of that stuff. For yeah. sure. Yeah, just like that old classic like rhythm game, you know, like yeah, yeah, me. absolutely. And then a fucking Dave was like, "I'm in on this immediately." <laughs> that's, yeah. like, that's all you had <laughs> yeah. to say. And immediately. <laughs> He immediately he was like, "Okay, here here's how it is. It's gonna be a boyfriend singing against dad, and dad is, and I think that works because he's this cartoon man. He can make these wacky scenarios. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm-hmm. Cock blocked by the devil, dad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I will only let you date my daughter if you beat me at fucking singing. <laughs> like, all right, man, you got yeah. me there, dude. Yeah. It's funny such too. a funny, like punky." like sexually forward kind of concept and that's i think part of what makes it so charming and hilarious is that you're always just fighting for the sex <laughs> you're always just trying to have sex with a girl and there's the blue balls if you lose it's it kind people, of just like on the nose write, lose. people write friday night fucking on twitter or just even on Newgrounds, like it's some <laughs> kind of joke like it's not intended from the get-go i'm always just right side eyeing those guys <laughs> like they're Wait, the ones making it up <laughs> rearrange the words Right. Who uh, who came up with the title? Actually, that was also Fri- fun. Friday night funkin'. He said, "Yeah, that was my first thought. Was like, okay, yeah. they're making a play on having sex on a Friday night. I'm like, that's clever. <laughs> you get it. <laughs> this dude's kind of a. Oh, I didn't, I didn't even. I didn't even think about that. I'm giving full credit here. Evil Skater's <laughs> the one who made the designs good. I drew them really fast for the jam, and then Evil Skater was in charge of making them not suck. And I initially gave the dad the pubes, and when Evil Skater changed oh the god. design and made it good, I was like, oh my god, these are amazing. But he took the pubes out of the dad, so when I did the final pass, I put the pubes back in. <laughs> oh my god. for the people. <laughs> Very essential to the design. <laughs> See, uh, Brute uh, and Evil Skater, those kids are, like, so young. Like, I think they're, like, 17 or something. But uh, yeah, yeah. Also, there he is. Speak of the devil. Um, hey, but <gasps> they're they're young enough. But it's 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 weird that they're so young, but they also have like the aesthetic, the art aesthetic that was like, you know, like early 2000s. And like every single time I see like artwork from them, it's like an, like they nail it like every time. It's like crazy. I don't so know if I've ever talented. seen cooler art than Kid Brute and Evil Skater stuff. You're so far away Fuck. right now. <laughs> Buddy, we can't hear you quite yet. Yeah, yeah, Wait, yeah. It's all right. showed up, you showed up just as oh, we were talking sick. about you, too. He's like, oh, why are they talking <laughs> yeah. about me? I'm in here immediately. That is cool, though. I, I was under the impression that uh, he did the, the dude on the right, and that you and then Dave did the dude on the, the left, and then you guys fought over the girlfriend or something like that. I don't know. Who did the Did Evil Skater do the girlfriend uh, drawing as well? Uh, oh. The one the one thing I can say that I did, I did the girlfriend. Evil Skater's made every other character look amazing. Yeah, it was like, they, they tossed designs kind of back and forth mm-hmm. like that. And it was like... Dave would do his like kind of flashy or not flashy, but you know, like his his kind of style and I was like, hey, do something with this, and then Evil Skater kind of made it, you know, like like add little touches and design aspects to it. Like uh like even stuff as little as the there's like the little symbol on the boy's shirt, and it's like just stuff like that where it's like, like whoa. That shit cool. Yeah, that the cool. uh the prohibit sign or whatever you want to call it, the circle with a slash <laughs> through it. And the, yeah, they made it iconic. I feel yeah, like the, yeah. the character art really took off with everyone who wanted to draw fan art because mm-hmm. you saw all this this crazy fan art coming out, like immediately just pouring through. I'm like, what has Cam done? Why is everyone so fucking <laughs> obsessed over this shit? Yeah, <laughs> like, really he's made a style that. icon. Evil scare. Yeah. Brag about yourself. Talk about how cool your shit is. Yeah. Uh, Showing that, to the mic from the rooftops. That design I took like less than an hour on. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I gotta say about it. <laughs> less than an hour. 
it went once once you sent back the original styling stuff then i then i had like a jumping point to go through but I, i'd rather he do as much stuff as possible since he understands like the graffiti and shape logic and he has that kind of like like quiet sprite said he's got that like spitfire 2000s like graffiti style so yeah yeah, yeah everything yeah. from the hat being backwards to the blue hair spiking out to the the evil determinate eyes on him and his little short stubbiness and the yeah. badass like big microphone yeah it's hella good style mm-hmm. especially during the the game jam when we just had like the weekend to do everything it was like you know, it's, it's like there. there's only a certain point when you can like, you know, pass designs back and forth. So it's like first day or so they did the the main dad and boy. But then it was like after that evil skater was doing like, you know, the, the background and like the little, you know, graffiti logo and like the, you know, the sick, yeah. good. Uh, and the those score little yeah. display things. Hell yeah, the like logo that. turned out fantastic, man. It really did. I want to ask, um, who got the most stressed out during these three days? Because uh, three days is such a short period of time to do everything. I feel like Ninja Muffin, since it, like you were programming, like that meant day and night. Because I saw it at some point you weren't even like sleeping at like one point. That's right. Oh uh, yeah. Well, one thing about this can, uh, jam was that it wasn't exactly it. It almost didn't get even stressful as much as like other game jams because it was like. Uh, like I worked, th- this is actually one of the first games that I've worked on where it's like, I've worked like a full, like five, six, eight hours every day during the, during the game jam until like the last day when it's like, I just stayed up all night and that's not like, and, and it, it, it kind of didn't even get stressful until like all these Twitter people came in. Otherwise it would have been like, Oh, just new grants game, just new grant. But mm-hmm. then it was like. It kind of got weird with all these like expectations for me, but in terms of like you know like uh, oh I gotta get this done, it's like like I knew it was gonna get done and I knew it was gonna turn out the way it did for that game jam at least. So it was like in my mind, it was like not too not too, not stressful. too stressful. But I want to hear what the the other boys say. All right, so quite right. You had to turn out music. Cam's like, yo, I need music for fucking dance, parappa to rapper. And you're like, <laughs> you're like, I'm on it, right? Like, what happened with that? Hey, guys, quickly, I'm sorry, but the uh, Craig is doing weird stuff right now. So I got to get him out and in or else we're going to lose a lot of stuff. Ooh. Hello, this is Word from the Editor. We experienced some technical difficulties while recording this episode. So we lost a lot of information a lot of funny jokes that, that Kawhi Sprite said. That's fine. We got everything else. Kawhi Sprite just mainly wants you to know that he'll make music with the boys anytime. And Kid Brute was also on for a second. And he ate a sandwich. So that pretty much sums up the six minutes of missing audio from this point on. And you're welcome. Wait, hold on. Did you get a link to the recording for the uh, previous recording? Yeah, I've been getting links oh. for everything. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. We back, baby. We We're back. Doing. Oh, God. I don't even know how to get back in the rhythm of things. Uh, <laughs> I Kid know. Brute joined up. He started chewing some food. Evil Skater uh, got referred to uh, Friday Night Funkin' because of Kid yeah. Brute. All right. <laughs> I have a question for you, Cam. When you're coding a game like this, what's the difficult parts of coding a rhythm game? Like, what makes it specifically what are the weird problems you have to deal with with something like that? Uh, well, when I when I when I did the jam or whatever, it was like I I kind of followed a guide. It was like how to make a rhythm game. And I just found it off Reddit like three years ago, and I've been using it ever since. But now I'm at the point where it's like I need to like actually learn how to do it, and that includes like mm-hmm. uh, one thing was like the the charts uh, that still give me a lot of headache is like the handmade chart editor and we have in mind where it's like we want to like make so that people are able to make their own charts and it's all like super intuitive but then that comes with like uh the part of that is like you know a more almost like software development rather than like making a game where it's like all this like actual good programming practices that i need to do so that things don't fall apart and like all these weird programming patterns <laughs> and all that Jesus. shit um on that note okay craig is once again not working 
He's been off and on enough times that I kind of don't think he's going to be working today. And so, guys, if you're listening to this, the audience, if you're listening to this, feel free to hang here. You can go to Just Talking and just kind of hang out. Do you guys want to? Do you guys want to take a little break and have us all kind of figure out the technical side together, and then we come back? Okay. Yeah. Intermission. Intermission. Go get yourself some popcorn. Go head to the restrooms. So now, now I'm all alone, huh? This is what you're gonna do to me. You're just gonna leave me sitting here. This guy's on a fucking roll. They, these assholes. They just left. They just hate us. Damn. Real genius hours. Yo, more people are joining. They're coming back to the the cool server. Cam, can you can you clear something up for me, Cam? Is his name really Will Coomer, like the meme? Cam, I'm drawing Miku. Can you tell me if I'm drawing Miku right if I send you a picture? This is I'm only just beginning, so don't be too hard on it. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Cam, did you see what that guy posted in what there? The, what's this? I've never seen this file in my life. I've never seen it. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how that got in the game files. It's kind of scary. Yeah, that's that's weird. How'd that guy find that? Block, get off the fucking microwave. I got a new design. Make it look good, Block. <laughs> get on it. There's the new, the, the new one, Block, damn it. Block, you're fucking it all up. You're fucking up everything. Cam, did you get did you get the game running on PlayStation, Cam? I'm trying. <laughs> you had Mike fucking Welsh in there with you, Cam. Yeah, Mike's a real one. Mike's Mike always hops into the streams and tells me how to program and how what I things know, it's mean. Kind of cheating having Mike fucking. <laughs> Welsh Dude, he is he is the number one score on the second week uh, of Friday yeah, yeah, Night yeah. Funkin' today. Mike, Mike's a real funkhead. He's a real funkhead. Like legit. <laughs> He's a mother <Yeah>. funker. <laughs> He's been telling me to fix a few things. He's like, hey, this this is annoying to get the score. Like, hey, you should you should have results screen at the end. I was like, I got you, Mike. I got you. <laughs> Literally just for Mike. Is there a results screen now? Uh, not yet. Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> I still, I got to draft up the assets for that. Oops. 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 Alright. I thought I thought last week was our worst fucking podcast episode. This No, this is the most awesome. This, podcast is, this is like This is like civilization crumbling. This is what this <laughs> fucking podcast is. Let's just let's just unmute let's just unmute everyone and then have everyone talk at the same time. No, we gotta get back that. to funkin'. <laughs> back to funkin'. Oh man. I know where we left off. I'm like I no, we, I don't know what's going on. Will. Just don't ask don't ask Block any questions until he gets his mic sorted out. Easy. <laughs> Will, what are you doing, Will? Have you given up? Are you sobbing gently in the background? What's going on? What's going on, buddy? Tell me. Here, let's ask Isaac. Isaac, how was Idaho? What was the wacky shenanigans with Idaho? And here we have a story by Kawhi Spray about his time in Idaho. There was a small Newgrounds meetup in Idaho. And Kawhi Sprite almost got murdered by some man that showed up the last night. Um, he smelled like socks. That's pretty much it. And the couch was like stained with a sock smell. This is 10 minutes of audio of Kawhi Sprite explaining this, but it was never recorded. Also, Kawhi Sprite hates planes. There's number one weakness. Yeah, I'm picking back up. We're going to talk now. We're going to, we got to fucking, uh, uh, we got to ask questions. Uh, Cam, favorite socks. Uh, Cam, what's your bus, what's your bus size? Uh, what's your blood yeah, type? Getting, I got all these wacky uh, uh, characters uh, uh, uh. and wacky boys in the chat. All right, all right, all right. Let's all right. start back off. Let's start back <laughs> off. Let's start back off. Okay. No, can an admin delete what Dave just, can an admin delete that? Admin delete that? <laughs> yeah, it's gone. We good, we good. <laughs> nice, 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 nice. I'm, being, I'm being silenced i'm trying to talk okay Fuck. all right all right we're probably never gonna get back on track but here we go here we go here we go here we go all right Game. five nights at funkin <laughs> friday night funkin okay Fr Very friday wacky. night funkin we got phantom arcade we got ninja Mother 99 we got evil okay. skater finally downloaded audacity we got quiet sprite all these fucking four people came together like um uh, like 
fucking over an evening like oprah and winfrey yes the avengers yeah yeah like oprah and winfrey we just <laughs> talked about how how stressed out either one of them was getting for from making the game turns out it wasn't stressful at all turns out cam understood the process entirely because he's a veteran well, at this well, point that was for the game jam the, the the stress part like making the game jam was a bit more easy than like kind of finishing it up because like even like May, uh, the new rounds release. I made sure Cam was stressed. For yeah, the, the new, new rounds release was much more stressful because there's like between me and Dave, we're like uh, kind of almo almost arguing. You might even say between like, no, we don't. We, we gotta wait. We gotta wait for the new rounds release. And I was like, no, we got a new rounds release. It's gotta come out tonight. And it's like I, I was on the side. I was like, I nearly <laughs> tore my hair out on the night that it released because I wanted, I wanted it to wait for other shit to get it. But like. What well, is like small small tweaks I would have personally made, but honestly, you know what? <laughs> yeah, but I think I think it's it's good it's good the way it came out. Everybody can cry harder. <laughs> yeah. If it wasn't for Halloween, like I don't know, fucking Halloween's fault. <laughs> well, I mean, Halloween yeah. worked out too because you got uh, senior Palos know. characters in there, and, and when you. Uh, when you launched the demo on Twitter, you said uh, senior player Palo actually came to you guys or whatever, and, and like actually sent like voice clips to make that song. Yeah, he's he sent like vowels over. He's like a a i o u, and then like and then and then he he's like we we had him record like like fun like weird sounds like haha or like yeah or like so spook. Me. That's what it is. That's what it sounds. Those are the samples, <laughs> and I just like sliced them up and auto tuned them. Um, which uh, that's basically like how you do the voice is uh, the voice of the boyfriend is actually my voice, but it's just pitched up and auto tuned. Um, like before, You're I would also just the like voice of the girlfriend too. Yes, yes. So if you go, uh, <laughs> you have to pitch it up, but you also have to ch uh, fuck with the formant, formant, whatever you call it. Mm -hmm. It's like left. Right, yeah. left, right, and then you, you do that, and it sounds like a female, right? But um, yeah, we I had to slice up Pela's voice and make like a sampler out of it, so we could use it, so I could play it like a keyboard rather instead of like the first couple of songs. I had to sing them manually and like slice up the audio and like auto tune it to make it sound like almost kind of like a Vocaloid, but not really. Um, but that is kind of difficult because mm -hmm. I always have to be like, beep, boop, 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 boop. like I have to do that. <laughs> I have to do a bunch of takes where I'm like singing something and I would like slice it up and auto tune it. Um, Jesus. But yeah. Yeah. I, I like how, uh, Palo just sends you over like the sound of vowels and he's like, yeah, you can make this into a song, right? Like, <laughs> like okay. <laughs> yeah. You deal with this. I don't know what you're going to do with it, but deal well, with we, it. We did yeah. ask him. For that yeah I, I sent Palo a message i said can we use your characters and will you be in our game and he was like yes yes yes, yes. Fan Arcade, i Qui love you i love you quiet spread has all the quiet spread has all like the advanced science for how to make all that shit work right yeah he docks this mm -hmm. all with the tutorial level i knew it was him though i knew he had that fucking specialty sound like a chick i don't i don't know how to say that <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> i don't no, know no, no, yeah Kawhi, what's it like making music that you know somebody's gonna have to like, like try to game and play? Like, are you writing the songs thinking, okay, this is gonna be moderately hard for someone to do? This one's gonna so, be easy, you know? The first couple of songs, the the breakbeat part was actually just supposed to be part of the track. It wasn't like supposed to be played. It was just like supposed to be like, like an intro, really. Yeah. And uh, Cam had the that part chart, and apparently, like a lot of people had trouble with it because it was just like. Holy like shit, the beatbox, you know, like the, the beatboxing part. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> ticka ticka poo, cat, that part. And um, Cam, I played this shit on hard. I saw the fucking notes that you snuck in at the end of the tutorial level, you <laughs> kid. <laughs> you gotta know that it's hard mode. It teaches you. It's all part of the game design. It teaches you that you're on hard mode. Sure does. That if if you can't beat those notes, then you're not gonna beat the other hard mode levels. Mm -hmm. It's all game design. <laughs> the, the thing is, though, the the faster and uh, harder the songs are, the more work I have to put in. Like, uh, like especially like the faster songs, where I was like, uh, 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 that's like that's a lot of work because I can't I can't mm -hmm. really like physically sing that fast. So I have to do more like magic audio magic to like make it seem like they're actually singing it or it sounds good. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. And then 
Cam has to fucking map it all out in his little special big brain way, which I saw on Twitter too. It's just like your programming way where you have like a grid or whatever. You got to map it out yeah. to a tempo, to Kawhi Sprite's tempo. That's That to me is impressive, the, the way you guys yeah, that's hard. Yeah. Well, for the beginning, uh, for the game jam, it's like I made like this, like uh, I wrote it up in the program where it's like it would read from like a, a PNG, like a 8 by like 16 pixel png or it's like the black notes and it's like all this weird shit that i did it's just so that we can get it out quickly on the game jam and it like worked good enough for the game jam but then like you know it got to the point where it's like okay we need to actually make a chart editor thingy even then i'm still like battling with it where it's like <laughs> <laughs> like all these little quirks like uh i would i would tell people like oh yeah you can you can make your own music but it's like or chart your own things but it's like it's almost like only I know how to use it because it's like all these weird quirks to it and it's like all these weird keybinds yeah. that I made like specifically for myself, but it's like like yeah. It Isaac, would be like the Isaac least Christi. user-friendly uh, audio, like a level editor of all time. People would have to yeah. learn way too much to actually, <laughs> actually be able to do it. <laughs> yeah, but it is there if people want to play around with, but it's definitely going to be just completely remade again. <laughs> is a uh, is a level editor kind of like on the docket? Would that be something you guys would be interested in doing later? Uh, yeah, yeah. Like level editor, people can make their own songs. People make their own kind of scenarios. But that's like uh much much later, and especially because like we want to get it right and make sure people can make cool things and not have to battle with it and people who do put the effort in can make something cool right i saw i saw like dave that. uh used ridge racer or whatever for a song and that was brilliant <laughs> what was that all about i don't understand that oh yeah ridge racer. Just, uh, <laughs> after after days of debating whether or not releasing the game at the time it was was the right call or not as Cam, as an offering of peace i just sent him the ridge racer thing and he boarded it and then he let me post it on twitter cam is Cam's the only one with the code. We all have to go through him. Unless you're wacky enough to be able to dive through it, Cam is the master codesman of the game. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Charts uh, only go through him. <laughs> I say what goes in and out. But yeah. Uh, with that, though, that, that the Ridge Racer, that, that was uh, just a wacky little thing. But going, going even way back, when I was making the new chart editor, like one of the first things, it was like, hey, chart this. And it was like the Smash Melee uh, oh yeah. yeah, yeah. You should post that today. Yeah, he did. He did break the targets inside the game, which is my favorite song. That's impressive. <laughs> I like that. The horizon's so big for for Friday Night Funkin'. Now I don't yeah. understand the secret. The secret seven. If you press seven, is that what you're talking about? Is like you can edit stuff like that. I don't like it. Yeah, but uh, right now you can't really do much with it other than like I guess swap songs. So but it's. Like you can't input new songs because I don't have that in because you need to like hard code it into the like back end or whatever and you can't like load in other songs and it's like this weird like you need to have the code. Okay. If you yeah. have the code and compile it all yourself, then you can add custom songs. I see, but... I see. So right now if you just press seven it looks fun. It looks like you, you hack the game for a minute, but really you ain't got <laughs> you ain't got nothing. That's fine. Yeah. What is uh what is the future direction of this thing? Because you got you got Dave who made the, the spooky boys for uh, uh senior Palo, and then you still got Avers Evil Skater for, for even more designs and etc. So literally you could like place anything in the game and like keep a concise narrative throughout it. So you got week one, week two right now. The 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 horizon seems endless, like honestly, for this type of creation. I saw your your new yeah. grounds news post too that you guys might be silently working out for next three years or try to get the funding or etc. Try to get a little bit of backing. Uh, to to kind of streamline this process. So, what do you think? What do you think is next for uh, Friday Night Funkin'? Dave can take this. What do you What do you think, Dave? Dave fan oh, yeah. arcade. <laughs> so, <laughs> with with the last game we were trying to do, which was the Must Murder Mommy game, which is a uh, ill fated. <laughs> Though the whole goal with that That's was to it. get it on uh, mobile on and like a ton of other things. And yeah. so the plan the plan right now is uh picking up where that left off essentially where like I i'm happy with this i like it a lot I, I think it's banger as hell everybody seems to be down and continue working on it and like yeah it seems just like i mean like every time i check the chat everybody's got like a ton of new ideas so mm -hmm. 
just to not only to keep expanding on the game and eventually offer all these cool tools to eventually allow user created content but i mean hopefully bringing the game like updating the the builds that are online with more stuff and bringing it to hopefully phones and nintendo switch if we can <gasps> Tiki. Ooh. You guys see that okay. awesome pitch? Yeah, I yeah, yeah. Right I saw Nintendo. that pitch. I didn't know if you were serious or not, but... <laughs> sent that right to it Nintendo. It very not serious, but I, I'm sure they're going to take it very seriously. <laughs> right. Well, no, but... when it comes to Newgrounds, you guys are obviously really serious about having, like, shit out on Newgrounds. Now, is there going to be, like, the full version on Newgrounds? Are you guys just going to aim for, like, marketing, like, a full version depending on, like, how it's funded or et cetera? Because obviously people would pay for this on Steam, or you know what I mean? Or... Wherever you guys oh, would yeah, want to yeah. No, Steam is definitely a plan one, too. Whoops. <laughs> yep. forgot, forgot that existed for a second. <laughs> okay, okay. But with that, with that, it's like, or with Newgrounds, it's like, it's like, right now the game on Newgrounds is like even, not even like a fraction of what we wanted it to be on Newgrounds. Like, mm-hmm. like yeah, so if even it does now come to it's Steam, like, it'll be big on Newgrounds still. Yeah. Yeah. And we, we intend to keep it, like, very closely tied with Newgrounds. I mean, like, there's... A lot of the work's already been done to have, like, Pico be playable. To have... I don't really want to name all the other characters exactly to build two crazy expectations. But, like... I mean, not only are we going to keep creating original content, but, like, that I hope that, like, the... Well, I, I know that the Newgrounds side can pretty much expand endlessly. In fact, if anything, I think we need to really kind of, like... Maybe limit exactly how much Newground stuff goes in to focus on the original stuff. But there is a lot of Newground stuff in the pipeline, of course. That's perfect. Yeah. That's great. That's that's exactly what you wanted. I mean, right now, the game has almost like, what, like 50,000 plays at this moment. And, uh, yeah, it's kind of wacky. You look at the scoreboard, <laughs> you see it's it's filled like almost every day. Or it's been yeah, filled. Yeah, the out. scoreboards are ruthless. I, I was trying to play South. I was trying to get a high score on stuff. It's like, oh, yeah, this, this, this level's hard. <laughs> so not that many people are going to beat it like I can. But then, like, I I beat it and i'm like not even in top 20 for the day <laughs> <laughs> yeah i saw you on uh week two you got thirty one thousand. mike fucking welsh mm-hmm. had one hundred and seventeen thousand, and <laughs> it's like oh my god it's yeah. impressive and then and then to talk about the music too it's like if you guys end up coming out with this full concise game it's like you got a whole album like you guys could market even like the music is fantastic i've been playing south there's just the song for it like the past three days like i love that song yeah man. yeah yeah thank, god. thank you uh i really don't have a problem making a crap ton of music for this because honestly i don't know if you guys like have seen like i'm always hustling like if i'm not making music for like uh, somebody else or for like a game like i'm making like just music anyway so i might as well just yeah that's have right. like a full ost that'd be great i mean just just <laughs> having this opportunity to make music that's like different and you know not something i would normally make maybe but also like mm-hmm. i don't know it's really fun because i it's still got your flavor well the thing is like the spooky month kids uh the 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 music for that was really hard to figure out because I was trying to say, like, I was trying to think, like, how can I make something scary, funky as well? Like, how do I make something like yeah. that, like, groovy? And how does it fit the aesthetic, too? With, like, the graffiti and, like, the singing, the boombox, like, shit like that. And it's just... You did a great job with that. Because it's easy for Halloween music to be super tacky and, like, you know, for kids. It's like, you could have done something with xylophones for skeletons or something like that, or (laughs) wolves howling. But yeah, what you got was funky and it did feel scary, but like in an original way, I really liked that. It was, it was, it was kind of tricky, but it was fun. (laughs) Chopping up Pela's voice too was, was kind of, kind of a hassle, but I figured it out pretty easily yeah you're learning more ways to fucking approach this subject and you made them seem like i don't want to say like ghetto but they're like there's some prime fucking rappers like they throw down the fucking heat dude i think you captured (laughs) i think you captured the characteristic as well as the halloween like uh, like kawaii sprite you're fucking killing it and it's like you said having a direction from this just having a reason like to come out with this kind of music is really piloting you forward so cam like what you've done like just by wanting to make a rhythm game has set off a chain of uh, events that that everybody loves on your team like the art is all 
fantastic. The music has purpose. And then you're just one fucking dude just coding the hell out of it. And um, would you want to give a shout out to like everyone uh, whose works you're, you're using? Because you said you're you're using, I think, Gio Corelli. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, Gio Corelli, he made like the Newgrounds API thingy for hacks. And I don't mm-hmm. I, I still don't know how that works on the back end. It just kind of works. Uh, <laughs> Hex Flixel. That's like Hex Flixel came from like Flixel, which was made by Adam Atomic and he made Cannibal. So it's this it's this the continuation of web. <laughs> nice. Cool web <laughs> games. Uh, so all that shit. Beautiful. Uh, yeah. Fizzed, Fizzed made Rhythm Doctor and that game uh, is a cool rhythm game. And that's on Newgrounds 2. And uh, that man, that man's cool. He he's he's working on rhythm games like all the time. And he wrote this guide on Reddit, and I found it years ago. And ever since then, I've been like, I, I want to make a rhythm game. And yeah. that man, yeah, I'm a redditor. <laughs> wow, what about it? Whoa. What about it? <laughs> yeah, but no, Zen, you were talking earlier about like how it's become a sensation and how you're kind of, we're just kind of finding out how many people love this kind of stuff. I felt like I missed the explosive popularity of it like i saw it come out and then i feel like i looked away and i looked back and it was amazingly viral what were some of the things that made it so viral so fast I think yeah what, what do you think Ken? Per, if, if i had to say it'd be you know like like the the original thing was like that twitter video right so i think if anything it was the like charm and of the characters mixed with like this like the the first fresh song like that first song fresh or I guess second one. Uh-huh. I think that one, like, both of those combined, it's like, whoa, what's this game all about? You know, like that shit. Yeah. Did the tweet get retweeted by somebody like an influencer or did it start? I guess Palo. To, like, Let's Players? Yeah, Palo. Palo was a big one. That's good. I guess. I mean, Dave, Dave retweeted it too. He's got a lot of followers. Yeah, yeah. Et cetera. Mm-hmm. And then it just kept on yeah. going from there. That was like literally overnight. Like,. <laughs> <laughs> yeah that was, well, think i it, think pillow is the missing link that i was waiting for because i was like yeah you can release it and people can like it but there's got to be something that happens and somebody that helps it get to at the huge place it gets to be so on it honestly has really been a great asset is. for you guys and i think just new grounds halo is always a huge help for new grounds i, I do want to say though like even Palo has always helped a ton with like all new grounds related stuff and this game but on, honestly if i had to place bets i, I seriously think it's like it's a mix between like a hunger for like that weird like PlayStation style shit, mm-hmm. and then probably like ninety percent of it is just fresh being like like a serious yeah. banger. It's like yeah, I want a rhythm. That's game the first with, thing I thought of. Yeah, yeah. It's like it's like people were like, I want a rhythm game with this music in. Like yeah, yeah. And well, they want a rhythm game. Period. How long has it been yeah, since yeah. like a decent rhythm game has come out? Like this is a perfect yeah. market. You guys hit the and then all the the fan art that came out of it. Like like well, you're saying Sir Senior Payload helped like pilot it, but really it's the designs. Like a shout out to the artist. Shout out to Evil Skater because everyone just took the designs and was like, damn, I want to draw this instantly. Like oh, great music, rhythm game, good characters. I can just redraw. Like there's a science to to making something to where other people want to draw, it. and I it just got hit. Perfect. Perfectly. Like you yeah. guys are. Yeah. Ooh. No, of course. I'm not trying to say that you guys' work wasn't the major <laughs> part that got it where it was, because it is. And, you know, you you're talking about there aren't many rhythm games. There have been, but they've been like more technical, I guess. The ones I've seen, the popular rhythm games have been more just kind of like technical and made for competitive play and high level skills. And there aren't that many anymore that have heart and like punkiness and cool style. So that's definitely an asset. Yeah. Too. There's like. Rhythm games that are like, you know, bright and colorful and flashy. Like, I guess I'll, uh, is it Beat Mania where it's like the two top rows and the yeah. two bottom rows? There's like, like, I think, you know, something like that. That's like one end of the spectrum. And then there's like Parappa mm-hmm. at the other where it's like kind of very accessible, super, you know, cartoony, I guess, you know, in that, in that yeah. way. So it's like, and, and we, we want to, not exactly lean more towards Parappa, but like, you know, be influenced I, by those like PS1, you know, charming, cool, wacky, and whatnot, kind of punk. I don't know, stuff like mm-hmm. that. 
It's like nice. I think that's what. All right, want. all right, all right, all right. So, Cam, you've never actually played Parappa the Rapper though, <laughs> and you Oops. haven't played Dance Dance Revolution. <laughs> <What>? Yeah. Oops. <laughs> I have played Dance that's Dance Revolution, honest. but I wasn't good at it, and that was like hmm. ten years ago. <laughs> <laughs> now, quite quite right. Have you played Parappa the Rapper? I was gonna say I also have not played that game, but oh my god, I know the soundtrack. Uh, I, I'm a DDR king, believe it or not. I can play like expert on a DDR. Dang! Like uh, my my icon on Twitter is uh, Alice from DDR. Uh, so it was like it was like really really fitting for some reason that like this rhythm game kind of like blew up and I just had like her icon <laughs> for, for my Twitter thing. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, like I I will yeah I don't know. <laughs> I love rhythm uh, games. I love Guitar Hero. <laughs> I don't totally know what it is, but people in the chat want to know if you've played Guitar Room. Guitar, Man. I have. Oh, I think Guitar Room Man. Also, I, I didn't name it. Guitar Room Man was definitely, and that uh, I learned about that from Wonder Boy. Influence. Wonder Boy like showed that to me like before, like the night of his birthday. It's like, hey, it's my birthday. Play this game. Oh, cool. I will watch you play this game. And what is it? It's I. I don't even know all the details of it. Uh, Dave, was was that made by the Parappa guys, Dave? I don't. I don't think that's Nana Onsha, but I, I just want to say I, I'll have Cam's back here. Cam was preaching the Guitaru Man like stuff the entire time we were making the game, and I've I've only ever heard like legends of how good Guitaru Man. Yeah, is. yeah. <laughs> oh man, uh, I completely forgot Guitaru Man was like essential to this in in a way where it's like this like PS One kind of charming like Guitaru Man's like very charming and like. Uh, in all the best ways, even even if it's may not. Th there's like all these weird quirks of Guitar Man. It's like if you're in mm -hmm. a song and you uh, press pause, it doesn't pause the game. It says uh, continue, and it's like retry, cancel. Like that's not a pause. Way. It's like if you pause, you just have to huh. retry the song. And it's like, <laughs> yeah, you can't stop and then get back into it if it pauses. Kinda, it's like, yeah. Oh, it's like, okay. You're it's done. It's like the most anime game. And it's like, so shout out to Wonder Boy for uh, uh, showing you Guitar Man. That. That, was, that was like a few days before the game jam. So that's that came from that. I'm looking at it. I can see how that style came through for you guys. This is definitely a lot of where that came from. At least. Especially like the way that the animated characters, like the, the letter characters that come on the screen. It's just it's very comic-y. Yeah, all that shit. Man, Guitar Man. That shit's good. That yeah. shit's good. <laughs> Thank you, Chad, for talking about Guitar Man. <laughs> yeah, shout, shout out, out Guitar Man. I think Arco mentioned that. But. They did. Um, Cam, shout out to you for completely ignoring the theme for Ludum Dare 47. <laughs> Listen, As I'm you should. Sick of Ludum the themes Dare. are nonsense. It's pronounced Ludum Dare, by the way, guys. Ludum Dare. Ludum Dare. <laughs> Is it? Are you sure? Because I've heard it. I don't think so. I've heard it both ways. It's I've Latin. heard it both ways, man. <laughs> <laughs> but it's Latin. The Funkin was supposed to be the yeah, loop though. Yeah. It was supposed to be it was supposed to be that like I have these animated cutscenes that aren't even done yet. They're just like barely started at all, honestly, because there wasn't any time to do them during the jam and or before the Halloween update really. But mm -hmm. I mean the whole deal is just that like, you know, the boyfriend and the girlfriend want to funk yep. each other. As they do. <laughs> and uh <laughs> What the fuck? Yep. <laughs> you know, like, the, just before they're about to get started, you know, the father rips them apart and just, you know, for, you know, flicks his fingers and you find the boyfriend finds out he's on stage. And that that happens <laughs> once every single week, which was supposed to be like the looping aspect. But since the cutscenes never got done, that yeah, never, it's Oh, is that where the weeks? Really like, wait a minute. Is that where the weeks come from? So that's why it's week one, week two? Is that like every time I guess, he gets I guess warped? now it'll be like every week a monster interrupts their um, funkin'. But like, okay. originally it was supposed to be just be like, yeah, every week her dad like gets in the way of them. Because um, <laughs> I'm invested you know, in this. I'm invested in the, like, the story of what is actually happening to this kid and his girlfriend and the dad and these monsters. So Most it's just people a story are of getting blue well. ball. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, people go nuts for the uh, what is it called? The story, yeah. whatever the plot. Like, uh, yeah, they'll go crazy. For it. I wasn't gonna I, ask I saw... like, is there gonna be more plot? Because like that, and that would seem to mean that the plot is what it has to be about, and that's not true. If there's no plot, then it's fine. Mario has no plot, but. Yeah, if if there does start to be a thing, then I'm instantly excited. Yeah, for it. yeah, and that's even during the Newgrounds release. Like we wanted like text and dialogue, and like e like the night before it came yeah. out, like I implemented it all in like an hour or two, and I was like, fixing it up. But then it's like we 
uh, or at least Dave. A at the time, I wanted him, but now I see it's like, oh yeah, we gotta, we can't just shove everything mm -hmm. in where it's like. Te the text was a rough call, cause yeah, like <laughs> we, I think we need to sort of get a more concrete thing down, but sort of like the general premise will just be that like they live on a very big planet full of very weird creatures, all of which are looking to in some way like cuck or kill the boyfriend <laughs> and try and ruin his life. Uh -huh. <laughs> and all of them for some reason want to sing to fight you. Yeah. They really are they really just don't want you to get laid. That's their whole motivation. <laughs> they really don't want you to get laid. That has a good reason for singing with the ex rock star thing, but the yeah, yeah I don't know. The spooky we'll characters, down, whatever, it's what it is. <laughs> well, I <laughs> I kind of like that idea. Like, what if they're trying to find a new place to fuck? You know what I mean? Come fuck at her house. The dad got in the way. Can't fuck Ooh. in this creepy castle. There's these spooky guys in the way. Can't can't fuck in this hotel. This this homeless <laughs> bum with a knife wants, it's gonna sing wants to, to you. sing me. Yeah, <laughs> like you, it could just be that. Yeah, got it. an angel. <laughs> So, but, but what I'm getting from this is that there's going to be animated cutscenes. That there's actually going to be like some type of plot eventually if you guys put out the full thing. Like, that's. That's all that's missing from the Newgrounds release, I would say, right? No, is that man. why you guys argued? That doesn't even is that cover. why you guys that argued? Begin to cover it. <laughs> well, I mean, result screen. I mean, this yeah. could be a lot flashier. But... Like a training oh, mode where it goes at half man. speed and you can learn it. I don't know. There's God, Dave is getting wet thinking about all the possibilities, have, man. But, uh, yeah. the... You don't even. <laughs> I mean, the chat's posting half the shit they're finding in the game's code and all the weird shit that's in there. That's it. I'm not open sourcing anymore. That's it. You guys is. Uh, yeah. What's the Phil Fish quote? All no right. more video games. Here's a question that uh, is <laughs> yeah. not going to be another feature request that terrifies you. If there's more story, are they going to have names? Are these kids going to have names or is it still going to be boyfriend, girlfriend, dad? It's dead. Ooh, Daddy Dears is the name. Daddy Dears is definitely the name. <laughs> but with the names, well, with the names, there's like these kind of canon, non-canon. <laughs> this these names, like yeah. Lewis on Twitter, he'll like shit. He's like, oh hey, what's their names? And I'll just say like I said that the dad's name was Lewis. <laughs> <laughs> just okay. because Lewis said it and then I think Lu uh, at least Lewis is calling the girl he's calling her Bertney he's calling the girl Bertney, Bertney? no 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 oh, I, I, I like that no, Lewis asked what, well what's her name and I was like Bertney <laughs> B-E-R-T-N-E-Y and he's like okay Aww. it's Bertney hey I, I love like, I Bertney Lewis, That's Lewis awesome. is developing the lore he, he's the, the fifth member of the team basically yeah Lewis is a writing consultant for you now. Yeah. He's the fifth Beatle. No, the sixth Beatle, I guess, for Kippert's us. Kippert's right? the fifth. Mm -hmm. oh. Seventh Beatle. <laughs> now we just got to get a name for the main kid. Let's see. BF. Um, BF. His name is... Zinzinitz. Gord. No. His name is... <laughs> his name is Gordy. No, we got we to gotta ask Lewis. You said Gordy? Gordy. Gordy's I was thinking, cute. what's the worst, what's the worst name <laughs> you, could, uh, you could give him? <laughs> Lizzie McGuire, <laughs> Gordo, Gordo and Bertney. Gordo and Bertney. <laughs> the thing with all this, they're made for each other. The thing with all right. this lore and canon is that there's like uh, this one dude. He like made this like wiki, this Fire Friday Night Funkin' wiki, and that's part of the reason why I want to just give out bullshit for the names and like all this lore because like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah if you just make it up it's you <laughs> you can make up literally whatever you want and it's canon you have a terrible power my friend <laughs> use it wisely or i really don't. want to troll that wiki and i kind of have in a way there's like uh some someone on the on the girls page uh someone wrote like women aren't real until the developer says so or whatever <laughs> that's some dumb <laughs> shit so in the intro text i put like women are canon add that <laughs> 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 that's what I meant. The intro text yeah. is an amazing part of the, the game. I love it. I have this idea. Haven't seen before. Yeah, yeah. I have this idea to name the, the boyfriend just like Beep. Beep. <laughs> beep. Beep is cute too. Beep. That is actually kind of cool. Jeez. That would be fitting. Beepo. 
Guys in the chat, what's the best one, Gordo okay, or B? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Here, here it is, here it is. Uh, hit, we need a Twitter poll, like Twitter Gordo. poll. Beep, no, man, BF, beep. and that means Beepo Fresh. B for BF, <laughs> that, that's his, his name is BF. <laughs> his name is BF. <laughs> <laughs> We've come like full circle, like god damn it. Beef, Calling another saying beef. beef. <laughs> I was saying beef. <laughs> I just like, I just I like Beepo. Beef as a name. <laughs> <laughs> Beep. No, but for real, the chat very much likes the word beep as his beep. name, and that's freaking cute. It's up to you. Beep, boop, it's completely up to you. All right, man. Beep, I like boop. Hey, if I get a perfect on one of the weeks, can I unlock a new outfit, please? Can I just, like, you know what I mean? Mm. Like, give me some, mm. something cool. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. The thing with uh, coming out with all these lawyers that people are literally hanging on the edge of the seats just to wait for you to fucking explain them. That way they can draw, exactly. draw some shit about them. You already know fri- uh, Friday Night fucking is going to come out. <laughs> yeah. Listen, no, one, gonna no one's put their out. money where their mouth is yet. No one's said that yet. Or no one's done it yet. We're still waiting. No one's actually done that for realsies yet. Yeah. Listen, we got to keep the lore mysterious because that's how we make millions and millions of dollars. Yeah, yeah. Is you that's make right. it like, you're like, oh, is the, you know, what is the story? It's like uh, just make it complicated. We're, we're, we're letting Matt Pat have it not make it. sense. We're letting Matt Pat. Yeah, leave it into leave something to the imagination because people will make up way more cool things than like what actually be yeah. real. As you're this seeing is today, Cam's as we're Kingdom only... Hearts. Yeah. It just goes on and on. Right. Yeah. Make like eight fucking books, eight long <laughs> novelization books yeah. with the Lord. Comes out with an before, anime. Um, before we, I don't. Before we do the i guess last bit to the show i you guys should make sure that we know exactly how to donate because i think a lot of people in here want to help you guys out i want to help you guys out so what's that donate and um uh, yeah picture. donate you go you can go to the itch.io page and that's linked right in the game if you play the game and click on donate it brings you right mm-hmm. to the itch.io page and that's the best way to donate because like if you want like the full because like uh I, I don't want to I don't want to get like, you know, Ko-Fi or uh, PayPal's to my like personal kind of email PayPal because then it's like, wait, is right, this for no. me or is this for the boys? And it's like and then it, it, it gets kind of sticky there. So if you put it towards into the itch, it gets perfectly split up between all the boys. Uh, OK, but also uh, one thing is uh, you can also put money into the two of the songs that Isaac put out on Bandcamp. And at some point, eventually, those will all the songs will be on Bandcamp, and then you can even give it more money. But like, that's also how you can support him because I do want those to be separate, where it's like Isaac can get yes. money from both. I, and that's exactly I, yeah. I really want to have like a full OST with like artwork and like have it look really really nice. Um, and uh, I don't know. I don't know how many songs we're gonna have left. So or we're gonna make. So yeah. I kind of want to hold off on that until it's all completed and we can just put it up and it looks nice. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there's the, yes. there's the money. Yeah, yeah, give yeah, us yeah. give us money and it'll be split four ways and we can. One, uh, <laughs> one thing with the money and going back to Guitar Room, man, it's like <laughs> when the first game jam, when the first game jam came out, where it's like Dave was talking about like, oh, hey, if we if we get enough, I want to buy a Guitar Room, man. So that was like. And th- uh, that game's kind of like niche and rare, so it's like a hundred dollars. And it's okay. like, oh yeah, look, we oh we my made god enough to buy one copy of Guitar Room Man today, and it's like <laughs> <laughs> as a group, yeah. And then we uh, we hold out until until we had enough money for all of us to buy a, a single copy each of Guitar Room Man before we did the first payout. But <laughs> okay, <laughs> that was that was the. Goal. I was thinking you're just gonna get one for the group, and you play it on Thursdays, and then Dave gets it we on Mondays. Around. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's it. Oh man, that was the guys in the chat. Any uh, last minute questions? These guys are here for you. You know, it's not very often you get to interview the <laughs> viral makers of the very viral internet. Someone's, game someone's asking Hunter. about Ridge and Smash. This the Smash one that that's the Smash chart, and I, I handily have that linked. So if you, uh, where is it? Is this the break? The if you skip to like seven seconds, you can see it play. <laughs> <laughs> this was the <laughs> this was the first thing that was charted in the new chart editor, so that's historically uh, so significant. Hell yeah! Tilcho asks uh, Ritz Deluxe, which I also kind of want to know about. Deluxe, this has Ritz nothing Deluxe, to do with Friday Night Pixel Funkin, Day. But... Pixel Day. Pixel Day will happen. Pixel Day. 
There it is. Hell yeah. Like yes. Are there Cam. are there any Easter eggs? Easter is eggs. Fuck, fuck is asking. Uh, <laughs> there's one that I still want to add. A guitar man one, but secret, Shh. secret. Nice. Uh, there's a lot of there's a lot that like I that were like on the table, and I still want to add. But right now, a lot of them are just in the intro intro little title screen. But yeah. secret. Well, if you do add Easter eggs, don't be afraid to tell us first and only, yeah, yeah. so that we can be the so ones. you guys, you guys can add that to the wiki. <laughs> That's right. We'll add it to the wiki, and then you can say, "This is real. This is canon. <laughs> I said so." <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of just secret stuff. Secret stuff. Wait, 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 wait. I got a question. I got a really good question. Cam, what are the biggest fucking complaints you get about this game? Uh, like, what, <laughs> what, what do people tell you? Like, what Call are people... these assholes out. Uh, yeah. Well, <laughs> tell me. I, I don't know if they're complaints, just notes. Or not notes, but you know. Uh, difficulty spike. And that's definitely one that I fixed just earlier uh, yesterday. Mm. And that was, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. That was something yeah. that like Dave was telling me about before the game came out. But I was like... Uh, I was like, oh, hey, yeah, we got to just get this out. <laughs> yeah, it does spike. It goes from Bopey Bo to ah, ah yeah. pretty fast. And yeah, yeah, yeah. It took me six tries to beat that. <laughs> Dave, what's what's the worst part about working with Cam? Uh Oh, he's got a list. He's got a list. The, he's unraveling <laughs> the scroll. I can hear the unrolling <laughs> the scroll. Oh, man. Oh, <laughs> to the goodness. floor. Let's see. Uh, nothing, nothing, nothing at all. With nothing. Cam is it's an empty list. That's though. so sweet. That's <laughs> nice. I'm very, I'm very mean to Cam all the time. I just, Cam will send me funny messages and I won't respond to them. I'll just tell him what's broken <laughs> and to fix it, <gasps> and then he'll just do it, and it works out pretty well. But then, I don't know. He'll fix like a hundred things in a row, and then I'll say fix this a hundred and first thing, and he'll be like, no. I'm like what? <laughs> what do you mean no? No. He finally puts his foot down, bro. Yes. So I've, had it. I've had enough. Buck stop. Yeah. So there you go. I'm a, I'm sitting over here. I'm just I'm just whipping Cam all day. Mm-hmm. I'm just mm-hmm. watching him play mm-hmm. Among mm-hmm. Us on the side mm-hmm. Discord thing. <laughs> Why Sprite? What's the worst part about working with Dave? Um. He smells. No. <laughs> well. <laughs> That's the thing is like Dave is kind of like our director, right? So he's like, make a song that, you know, just just make a tune like, uh, and then he gives me like uh, examples from like other games too that I don't I've never even heard of, mm-hmm. which is uh, I'm pretty bad with that. My my main like like kind of, uh, what what's the word? My main thing that I'm trying to do my th- the best I can is to make it fitting to like the vision and uh you know just make it look make it have all everything aesthetically fit like the music the art uh i don't know i don't i don't think it really i i've like <laughs> th- making the music has been like the easiest part i think out of all of this mm-hmm. just because like i i do it like instantly not to toot my own ass but that's just how i work right i just <laughs> I just I just work really really quickly and it's it's really really fun. The one yeah. thing I feel bad about is uh, that one time that like you 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 uh, you you posted the tutorial song and then you made a slight tweak, and then I remember I I called you <laughs> about the one tweak, but then I was like, can you do it like this? And you're like, actually no, I don't think I can. I was like, okay, and then then you actually released the full song. And then that one has more plays on my phone now than the original one. So I don't know. Oh, yeah. After that, I just I, I don't say a shit to this guy. This guy knows what he's doing. I don't need to tell him anything. The, well, the thing yeah. was, I, I would like post into like our Discord thing. I was like, you know, just to get like a reference of like what these guys want. Yeah. Right? So I'll start like a demo kind of track thing. It's like, how about this? You know? Yeah. And then usually most of the time it's like, oh, that's cool. You know? And they're like, okay, I'm going to like add more stuff to it. And they're like. Oh, it wasn't done. Oh shit! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and uh, I do that a lot, where I'm like, I kind of want to show them first before I work on it a little bit more. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Just to just to see, and just to gauge their reactions. Be like, is this good? That was with fresh, it, fresh. All right, all right, all right. Evil skater. Uh, who do you like working yeah. with the least? <laughs> uh. Which one's the most? Nobody. Which, are nobody. you really that nice? I heard you were me, man. I heard you threatened to rip Dave's ears off. Quit. I just want to. We all thought you were violent. <laughs> yeah, we expected something. No, they're, they're all nice. 
They're nice to me. No, oh, that's nice. That's nice, bud. You guys are no, one big happy now family. I, now I feel bad that I lied and said you I were a psychopath <laughs> before you came into the call. <laughs> He's making you feel bad. That's how this works. He's milking know it. Know your place. Know your place, Block. Know your yeah, place. Yeah, Evil Skater. Why were you late, Evil Skater? Explain that. Hmm. Yeah, you were driving uh, the car. <laughs> how dare you? Yeah. Oh, I was Yo, what in the fuck? House. You have a driver's what license? <laughs> no. No, I don't. I skated. Yo. Oh, shit. <laughs> Jesus. Sick. Oh, my God. Well, hey, guys, this game is special. I really hope you guys know that from how excited the chat is, how excited we sound from all the success you've been getting and will continue freaking getting. Uh, and... Thank you for being patient with the weirdness today and the technical weirdness today. Oh, uh, what technical <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. weirdness? But I just wanted you to know that I'm super psyched that you guys were able to be here and talk to you about this. Yeah, God bless. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Christmas update? Christmas Christ update? <gasps> hmm, Christmas update. Hmm, hmm. How about Christmas update? Hmm. Memorial Day update. Hey, hmm. uh, yeah. Veterans <laughs> Day update. Uh, Martin Luther <laughs> King Jr. <laughs> day update. Yeah. Sweetest day update. Yeah. Yeah, something... Zan, you want to help wrap it on up? Anything yeah, else you yeah, want to yeah, say yeah. to our guys? Yeah, uh, uh, Thank you guys for being here. Thank you for suffering through technical difficulties. Uh, you're yeah. all tired. You're Who's all going to go to sleep or, or fucking eat ramen or something after this. What's everyone's um, new um, grounds? Um, What's everyone's new grounds? Yeah, what is mm -hmm. everyone's new grounds? Uh, uh, Phantomarcade.newgrounds.com. NinjaMuffin99.newgrounds.com. Phantomarcade 99. 3000. That's his new grounds, man. <laughs> no, Tom changed no. it. Andre, what is it? Andre3000 oh, now? <laughs> <laughs> we'll find it. His old ass <laughs> name is 3000. I'm Ninja Buff in 99 yeah, right. on Newgrounds yeah, forever. Just change forever. It. Just change it too. forever. I'm not going to change it like this coward. Yeah, yeah. Black, black, black. Tell black. him like it is. Black's Newgrounds yeah. fucking is that uh, evil skater. How do you spell that? <laughs> it's uh, evil uh, SK8. Eight. 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 Yeah. <laughs> one thing, one thing with right. blocks is that before before the game came out, his name was like Blockman Twenty or something. It was like oh, Blockman. Yeah, yeah. yeah <laughs> and I kind of wanted you to keep that. I kind of wanted you to keep that because I wanted like this like twenty follower Blockman Twenty. Just like like it's like no one that I know, <laughs> no one that knows me, like almost knew you at that point so it's like i, I kind of just wanted this like random like block man tony is like oh yeah this guy this guy's like was essential yeah. to the team <laughs> it's just this funny name you guys are all essential to the team and the team yeah, is yeah, essential yeah. to us what's kawaii yeah, sprite's yeah, yeah, new yeah. <laughs> name how do you spell that kawaii sprite uh, 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 there's one i in kawaii k-a-w-a-i sprite Baby, yes. yep. right. Dot, like dot the new drink. Right. Well, the baby's not in there though. <laughs> We're gonna wrap this up and quiet. We're gonna let you sleep because you've had three hours of sleep in the past ten years. So we'll get you out of here. But one more I feel time, like a hundred Chuck, Chuck E. Cheese tokens. <laughs> Don't worry about me. Cool. <laughs> well, guys, yeah, geez, thank you so much for coming on. Thank you so much for giving us all Friday Night Funkin'. And I hope you guys have the best of luck in developing it more and just continuing to have fun yes. and let us have fun with it. Kickstarter, Patreon, uh, everything, Indiegogo, <laughs> it's all coming soon. Uh, mm -hmm. Investors, <laughs> we're looking into those also. Uh, Oh, if you want, if you all want the to secret find Nintendo employees sitting in the <laughs> chat, <laughs> or free. If you if you guys want to uh, find my music, it's not actually kawaiisprite.bandcamp.com. It's drug pop. So drug it's pop. Drugpop.bandcamp.com is all my music. That's where all the Friday Night Funkin' OST will be uploaded when it's finished. And uh, just know that drug pop is actually me. Uh, maybe yes. I'll change it, but that's how you can support me if you want. And uh, you should probably put that out there too. Nice. Support Kawhi Sprite. Yeah. Support people. Kawhi Sprite. Support art. Click this yeah. Do donate to, to the Friday Night Funkin' fandom. So we can, <laughs> the fandom. <laughs> yes. So, well, not, don't, don't donate to the fans, but donate to us so we can make a <laughs> crazy ass cool game. Donate to the donate. fans. <laughs> yeah. And donate to New All right. They don't need the support money. Support New Grounds. Support right, New folks. Grounds. If I, I, the last thing, support New Grounds. Support, support Newgrounds. New grounds. Yeah, support Newgrounds. Support Newgrounds. Support Newgrounds. Support Newgrounds. Fuck it. Yeah. Don't play it on there. Put it on, play it on Newgrounds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Put it on Newgrounds. Thank you, guys. Let's see. It's good to be back in the NGP. Good to be back where I belong. Yeah, yeah, good yeah. Can we back. get that outro music? Can we get that? Can we get that funky outro music? <sighs> no, because of the technical oh, stuff yeah. earlier. But we can oh, sing what? outro wait, wait. music. I can, I can, I can beatbox. Oh, right? I can do it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> 
Thank you for listening to the New Grounds podcast. This show is recorded live on our Discord server. Join us at bit.ly slash NGP Discord. For the latest news, follow us on Twitter at the NG Podcast. Thank you to Waterflame for the use of his song, Gabberfly. Goodbye. Oh, I was beatboxing. He said, going. welcome, I was go. Ninja Mo- He said, welcome. Cam, we're fucking leaving. <laughs> it's, we're going away now. Are you guys ready? Part two, one more hour. The audio is <laughs> <the, the laughs> fading out. Uh, I'm stopping my recording. I'll just stop yeah, the recording. Yeah, me too, me too, me too. Hey, Cam, did you update the, the itch? The itch? Oh, I'm still recording. I'm letting it all go. Just me and everyone else now. You're all alone. Stuck with me. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> uh, hey guys, I'm Will Coomer and uh, Zinix, and welcome to the New Grounds Podcast. Today I've got nobody. Everybody's leaving the room. <laughs> also, I, Will is gone from the call. I was I drew a fake picture of him. I was gonna draw a real one, but I mean he left. We can still here, but he's muted. <laughs> oh man, that makes me laugh. Damn, <laughs> I'm busted. <laughs> oh no, okay, what are you doing? Get out of here. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, Jet Set Radio. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop my, I'm, I'm gonna stop my audacity recording.